All right, so I'm here with uh, the producer of Harlesque Burlesque. Yeah, hello, my name is Harley Harper and I'm a burlesque producer in Los Angeles, California. I've been producing shows for roughly a long time now. I'm gonna say at least six years. Um, I've been dancing um, for about eight years, I would say, maybe approaching 10 now. Now I'm getting scared, now I'm <laughs> thinking about the dates. Um, but I was originally more of like a jazz modern dancer and I went to college for dance and then I progressed into the burlesque world. And so now I've been doing it ever since and I really love my journey that I've been on. Sure, sounds yeah. good. Now I've seen you around town like in, with other burlesque troops, but mm -hmm. this is your own produced show. Mm -hmm. How do you differentiate it from uh, other performances? Um, I love producing my own shows as well as being a part of other people's shows. I really love that. Um, what's nice though is when I'm not producing a show, there's less stress. Sure. Um, it's a little bit more stressful when you're producing because you're also managing, making sure you know all the producers get here on time, making sure everything. You know, and I host my shows as well. Yeah. So I'm hosting and producing and I'm performing. So it's a lot of stress and, and one thing. Um, so when I get to do other people's shows, it's so nice because then I can really focus on my routine. Mm -hmm. I can really focus on my number. And that is, I mean, I, I still love what I do regardless. <laughs> and you know, when I'm producing and hosting and performing, it always turns out to really well, but still, um, it's so nice just to focus on my one routine. With all your experience in burlesque, what do you think is like the weirdest thing that's ever happened? So the craziest thing, one of the craziest things, I've had many crazy things happen to me, <laughs> but one of the ones that I can uh, feel free to talk about is um, how I met one of my um, my sound people. Um, and um, their, his name is Lucky Dave. And I met him when I did a burlesque show. When I first started burlesque shows, I started in strip clubs, which is kind of okay. like a fun fact. Um, so I did this show at a strip club and it was a fetish show. Sure. It was a fetish burlesque show and my fetish was um, splashing, which is like uh, throwing pies, cakes, whatever, <laughs> and and feet, okay. mostly mostly with feet, and um, I stuck my foot. So whoever, okay, wait, <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait back this take up. your time, take your time. So the winner of my game, because you see I have a lot of games. Sure. The winner of my game was in the chair for the lap dance. I was giving the lap dance, and um, I put my foot in the pie and I put my foot in this person's mouth okay. and this person was like enjoying it so much <laughs> that they um, kind of like grabbed too much of my toe and they got a teeny bit of my skin and I bled a little bit like afterwards you okay. know what I mean so like that was like the weirdest but the best experience ever because that person ended up being one of my sound people for years ah, okay. and we built this amazing relationship we're still really good friends to this day and it's just crazy how you can find the most amazing people on the, the most interesting experiences so i guess that's the weirdest thing that happened was that that happened and that person tend became one of the best people <laughs> in my life so um that that's probably the weirdest experience and i All hope right. i said that correctly yeah, yeah. That. so like uh, we're just uh right getting right into the beginning of 2024 uh mm -hmm. what can we look forward to for the rest of the year? i have a lot of exciting things coming up some of the things that i can't disclose of course um but i have some fun burlesque activities coming up i just can't disclose it <laughs> i have a lot of great shows what's in the near future is i have my birthday show coming up january 31st here at Idle Hour. So my birthday is on February 3rd. I'll be celebrating early, January 31st. I'm so excited because that's when I can just really let it all hang loose and like <laughs> have a good time. So that's the most exciting thing in the near future. Um, but please follow me online at Harley Harper on Instagram, Facebook, TikTok, all the, all the things um, for more updates on some things that I can't reveal quite at this moment. Cool. Yeah.